Hi guys, this is Saurav. In this video, we will learn how we can create BMI calculator in MIT app inventor. Okay, so let me show you the example of this app first. So here you can see that's my calculator, BMI calculator here, right? And you can see your height in inch, weight in kg, and that's the calculate button. And that's the BMI score here, right? So there is now BMI. So let me just put my height, okay? So my height suppose is 172. Okay, and now my weight is suppose 65. Okay, now click on this calculate button. And you're fit, maintain your current diet. All right, your life is normal, you are fit, maintain your current diet. Okay, now if suppose someone weight is suppose 40, 40. Okay, and click on calculate. You are underweight, eat more frequently. Right, you are underweight, please eat more frequently. Suppose if someone is overweight, so how we can put if some someone weight is suppose 95, click on calculate. Focus on eating low glycemic index foods. Right. So that's the BMI calculator doctor app, right? So where you can get the instruction also and your BMI score also, right? So that's very simple app to create. Okay. So let me show you how we can create this app. So here we go. So we are using your MIT app inventor to create this app. Click on project new and that's my BMI calculator and okay now that's my first screen here now I have to drag and drop here first text box to put my height and for this one is for weight okay and now I have to drag and drop your one button to calculate the value now I need one more thing that one is one layout to display my value Okay, so I'm going to make this one height is fill parent and width is fill parent like this. And I'm going to drag and drop your one text value. Where is this one? Text, sorry, label. So this label will display the value of a BMI. Now, click on vertical element and make this center and this one is also center. And change this label uh, at least text should be bmi something and make this font size at least 30 no not 330 okay now this default vertical arrangement background color i'm going to make it pink like this click on this text box phone and make this one with this fill parent and make this one is also with this fill parent okay now click on this text box 2 and we have to set your weight weight in kg kilogram and you can change this text to as a hint text okay so i'm going to delete this text and paste it here like this that's our hint text and here we will put our height so in the hint text we will put your uh your height in inch okay your height and your weight and that's the button so i'm to make this button to calculate okay and make this one is also with this fill palette and change this background color to pink and you can change this background color to orange also and make this one font size at least 16 make it font bold fine now that's look pretty uh good okay you can change this background color to black also like no, no that's the second color i'm going to change this background color to black how this one is look yeah this one is looking fine right now that's the overall design of our app now let me just drag and drop one here extension so how we can do this so first we need to download extension okay i will give it this extension link in the description okay so you have to download this extension from here so just click on this AIX file and go to the MIT App Inventor app, click on import extension and drag and drop this extension here and import it. Now drag and drop this extension here in the screen. That one is non-visible component. Okay. Now go to the block section here. Okay. And whenever someone click on this button one, it means whenever someone calculate the BMI. If we have to calculate it. You can see there are three types of uh, blocks here, right? In the second block, you can see here if you're going to choose this one, so you have to put your weight in the kilogram and height should be in a meter. 
in this third block you have to put weight in the kg kilogram and in the height is a centimeter and if you want to choose first ones you have to put your weight in pounds and height should be in an inch so what i'm going to do here i'm going to put this one third one weight in a kilogram and height in a centimeter okay so drag and drop this here now we have to display this value in the label click on label and you can see label one dot text this one just drag and drop this here like this now drag and drop this here like this now we have to get weight and height right so go to the design and you can see this one text box one okay so this one is a height okay so text box one dot text should be our height it means here okay and copy and paste this and text box two should be your weight going to be weight right so that's the value now we are going to use some condition here okay so click on this control option and you can see if a condition like this so first we have to set the label one dot text value okay this will calculate the bmi calculate bmi value and display here in the label one wait but we have to check the condition if the value is so how we can check it so just type in google and here just type here put uh, a score of bmi okay just type here and you can see the for for most adult an ideal bmi is in the 18.5 to 424.9 range okay this one is ideal okay and uh, you can see the people's age and you can see now let me show you that if the value is under 18.5 then we will display the underweight okay if the value is 18.52 between 24.9 then we will display the values normal the human is a the person is a normal but the bmi value is going to be a four, uh, going to be a greater than 25 or 25 then we will display as a overweighted okay so in using this condition we have to uh, we will change the background color of this uh, this vertical arrangement also we will use here text to speech option for some instruction so you can see the option of media here this one and text to speech this one drag and drop this one is also here right go to the block fine now we have to check the condition okay so click on maths and you can see the equal this one drag and drop this here if the tag label one dot text it means this one value is less than it means less than and the value is 18.5 if the value is less than 18.5 then we have to set vertical arrangement two dot background color this one background color should be uh, red okay this one is color and this one is red okay because you are underweighted and we have to display one more thing that we will add here label one dot text value like uh, click on label one and you can see label one dot text set this value and we have to join this text so i'm going to use this one and i'm going to use one more string here like this and label one dot text value it means this one value it means suppose underweight underweight and in the new line so how we can use your new line so we have to use your backward slash and and right and we will display your underweight under weight okay and we will use here one more thing speech text to speech no this one is this recognizer wrong we have to delete this text to speech this should be go to the block and text to speech and we will call here so we will we can display any message here so i'm going to display simple you are underweighted okay and you're underweight and eat more frequently for underweight eat more frequently that's the instruction for the underweighted guy now i'm to use your under condition it means else if and i have to use another one more condition right so for that we have to use your one more thing that one is logic and using add this one and copy this if condition here if and just paste this here one more time if the label one dot value is greater than okay it is greater than and equal and is less than 
25 less than 25 then we will use your we will set this vertical arrangement color going to be green okay this one is a good sign for green okay and we will use your we have to display the value right we will display your value is normal okay like this and we are going to use your this one text to speech and you can see you can just type your your now in the last stage if someone uh, like uh, the score bmi score of their their bmi score is greater than it means this one is 25 okay less than 25 greater than and equal to 25 then we will set this vertical arrangement to something you can display the uh, related to green right and related to dark green something like this one is also not good and just set this value to overweight or over overweight okay and you have to use your one thing that text to speech and what you can write here you can write something like copy paste this one syntax and paste it here okay you can choose according to your uh, like your uh, your comfort right like this simple now that is fine that's overall code okay now let me run this app and how this app work okay so now you can see your height in end so if i'm a height suppose okay 170 okay and the weight is 67 okay now click on this calculate button okay and you are fit right maintain your current diet great you are normal and you have to maintain your current diet suppose my height suppose my height is something suppose 32 okay and weight is 67 and let's see focus on eating low glycemic index foods okay i'm overweighted and let me just if someone have like a uh, weight is weight is 67 okay and the height is 190 and weight is 45 click on calculate you are underweight eat more frequently right you are underweight please eat more uh, more frequently right so that's why the easy way to create this bmi bmi calculator okay so thank you so much for watching this video let me know if you have some doubt on this so just comment on the video please 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 subscribe my channel like this video share this video have a nice day be safe bye bye